Hello, and welcome back to the Troop 457 Scoutmaster Minute. I'm Mr. Maloney, your Scoutmaster, here with the latest updates and insights for our troop. Let's kick off with a huge congratulations to Yorick for completing his star rank border review last night. Yorick, your hard work and dedication to scouting principles have truly paid off. Well done. Now, let's talk about some fast approaching RSVP deadlines. Next Monday, January 15th, is the deadline to RSVP for our troop ski trip. You must RSVP on the troop website, not troop track. See the invitation for additional instructions. Don't forget to check out so that your RSVP is recorded, and be sure to contact me if you run into any issues. Remember, we cannot accommodate late RSVPs for this event, so make sure you sign up no later than January 15th if you plan to attend. Monday, January 28th, is the deadline to RSVP for two events, Scout Sunday, which is on February 4th, and the Moraine Trails Council Klondike Derby, which is on February 10th. Speaking of Scout Sunday, we will need additional scout and adult volunteers to participate in the service and help with the pancake breakfast. See the Troop Track invitation for instructions on how to let us know if you would like to help. Before we move on to next week's activities, I wanted to take a moment to reflect on what we've learned completing the Chess Merit Badge over the last two weeks. Chess is more than a game. It develops critical thinking, strategic planning, and patience all important skills that extend far beyond the chessboard. It teaches us the power of foresight and planning. Each move requires us to think several steps ahead, anticipating our opponent's strategies and adapting our own. These skills transfer to our daily lives, enabling us to make informed decisions, set goals, and navigate challenges with resilience. Chess also hones our concentration and focus, in a world filled with distractions, the ability to tune out noise and focus on the tasks at hand is invaluable. By training our minds through chess, we cultivate the mental discipline needed to excel in academics, work, and other areas of our lives. Chess also fosters patience and perseverance. The game unfolds gradually, demanding persistence even when we're faced with setbacks or difficult positions. It teaches us to analyze, reassess, and find new approaches to overcome obstacles. This resilience carries over into our personal journeys, reminding us to stay determined in the face of adversity. Even more importantly, chess is a social game that brings people together. It encourages friendly competition, sparks conversation, and bridges generational gaps. Through chess, we forge connections, learn from one another, and appreciate diverse perspectives of valuable skill in our increasingly interconnected world. Let's embrace the game of chess and recognize its importance in our lives. Let's develop our critical thinking, strategizing, patience, and concentration. Let's approach challenges with resilience and build connections with others. Just like scouting, chess is a powerful tool that shapes us into well-rounded individuals ready to conquer the complexities of life. Now, as we close out this episode, let's look ahead to next week's troop activities. We have several meetings happening next Tuesday, starting with our Patrol Leaders Council meeting at 6 p.m. Remember that all our newly elected leaders should attend this meeting. Our patrol and parents meetings will follow at 7 p.m. These meetings are crucial for all our scouts and parents to attend as they offer a great opportunity for everyone to stay informed and involved in our troop activities. That wraps up this week's Scoutmaster Minute. Thanks for tuning in and remember each step in our scouting journey is an opportunity for growth and learning. Until next time, this is Mr. Maloney signing off. Keep on scouting and let's make every moment count.